junk. No, I need... Damn it, dude. Grab this one, come on. There it goes. You kidding? Okay. Grab that then. Then this would be all. Sorry, Sabeel. <laughs> I'm gonna be super weighed down. Okay, now my thought is something like this. Slam. I hope that works. Alright, bam. Alright, send that fireball to Sabeel too. Alright, let's do this. Save. Just in case. Cast. Okay, well, you're just gonna have to eat a fireball, Sabeel. Sorry. Here then? Aha! What? What's happening to the shrine? Haha! -ha! Cool. <laughs> Stop burning yourself, it's cool. Come on, everyone. Come on up here. There you go. Sorry, Seville. But you did the thing. Good job. As the torches around you flicker and crack to life, you hear a low groan. It starts soft, then crescendos until your chest rattles and your head buzzes. Rockers! Jeez. Oh, did I do a bad? Yep. <laughs> did I hurt him? Blood boils in a death, and you ask if it hurts. The indignity fans the flames. Just when the agony subsides. More come to the shrine and put flame to the torches. They think to honor me. Instead, they incinerate me. Sorry, bro. Who are you? Summon me, but don't know my name. I am the great prophet Patrick. I knew Bracchus. I knew his secrets. I saw his rise and fall as woven into the tapestry of time. He branded my truth as blasphemy. And I burn for it! What can you tell Volumes, me? But the prophecies are meant for divine... Wait, you! It's you! Mm -hmm. I see it! You too follow a path consumed by fire! Mm. You must take my gift from among the flames! With it, you will know truth! With it, you can... The rumble reaches a deafening forte, then dissipates. The voice is gone. Only the whisper of the wind fills your ears. Brackus silence him? Oh, neat. Garbage. Garbage. Really? Not even worth it. The statue is as still as the air that surrounds it. All right, uh, let's put it back out. There you go, buddy. The statue stands. Oh, 
Oh, it's a book. It's a book. Book of Prophecy. Okay. Mm Oh, sorry, mate. Didn't mean to do that. Sounds pretty crappy. All right, let's go down here. Should have done that earlier, but better late than never. Feels like there's going to be something over here. Auto save. Hmm. This is suspicious. Really? There's nothing here? That feels lame. Ancient lamp. I'm gonna summon a genie. Lying at your feet is oh. a strange lamp of ancient design. Spots of gold shimmer through the thick grime that coats it. As you hunker down for a closer look, the lamp jerks slightly, almost imperceptibly. Prod the lamp with your boat. Grab a rocket, smash it. It's going to be a genie because it wants me to rub it. Weird treasure is still a treasure. Right with my boot. Hiding in the sand underneath scurries away. The lamp doesn't move. Oh boy. Sure. The lamp feels strangely hot to your touch. As you wipe away the years of dirt and grime, it trembles in your hand. Heavy smoke spills out of the spout of the lamp, falling to your feet, where it flows away from you. The vapor arches into the air and starts to take shape before you. It's a freaking genie. Someone's... What? what? Oh, it's Jin. Oh, that's a wizard, isn't it? The story of Jin. His face twists into a sneer and he flexes his claws. It's a... Lizard genie. What's wrong, God Woken? Did the Seven turn you down too? Or are you here seeking even more power? I should strike you down where you stand, God Taint. Why don't you like me? Man, we always play Seven turn you down. Hmm. <laughs> That's funny. Why would you kill me? Because it would be a kindness. I've known the power you feel, the promises you were made. I too was named God Woken once. My God gave it all. Power, glory, hope. It was intoxicating until she took it away. Deep inside, you can feel your God stirring. It's recoiling, revolted. No wonder Zor Stissa turned this one away. Is Zolstissa the god of unworthy. lizards? Unworthy to be divine, so she gave it to another. What kind of a monster gives you that power only to strip it from you? To promise you will be the light of the world and then cast you into darkness. Divinity can only be granted to the best you have to say you agree with the gods. That's a hero? Damn. What did you do? There was so much wrong with the world. So much that I needed to fix. So I sought power elsewhere. Oh, that makes sense. The void said I could have eternal power. That's why you got stripped. I could be the light of the world. And it delivered. Why would the I void unlike any God -woken. want you to be the light? Freedom. It laughed as I was sealed away in that lamp. Be the light of the world, God Woken, it said. Even so, there's more honest than your hellish seven. Do 
You have his lamp. Get me three wishes. Power or not, you won't deal with some creature enthralled to the void. I can understand your reasons. Understand it or don't. I'm not here for pity from some god's plaything. And I'm certainly not here to hand it my power. You and your gods were a blight upon this world. I would rid the world of your corruption, not help you spread it. Pretty sure he wouldn't be afraid of strength, right? Grant me a wish or spend the eternity at the bottom of a well. <laughs> Not all gods woken are bad. If you have the god's power, you can fix their mistakes. The land protected him from the horrors the gods unleashed on the world. I don't know which one to do here. I don't know what to do here. I kind of want to say... The gods unleashed the one in this world. Oh, it worked. They, they turned on mortals. I knew they were mad, but that... I've suffered enough. Why would I ever want to return to a world doomed to suffer under the gods? I should have never left the lamp. Smoke starts to whip around the base of his feet, creeping up to his body. I will not repeat that mistake. Goodbye, Revelon. The smoke envelops the gin completely before sinking back into the lamp's spout, leaving you alone with a silent, inert lamp. Could I actually have gotten a freaking... ...wish? Aw, oh, man. Silver, how's it going? Oh, speaking of doggo cam, I forgot to turn it on. How are you? Haven't seen you in forever. Thanks for dropping in. There you go. Doggo cam. Boop. That's a Jada. So I got this genie lamp. It's worth two grand. Okay, maybe it's worth money. I don't know if I could actually gotten a wish. Alright. Well, I don't know if that was worth it coming down there, but it is what it is. Let's go up here. The little yes, that oh, have you not met Bird? That's Bird. <laughs> yes, he's our new friend. Yeah, it must have been longer than I thought since you've been here, because uh, we've had Bird for at least a month, I'd say. Doggo Cam, uh, actually, the yeah, Doggo Cam is fairly new. That's maybe a week. Quite good, or quite busy overall good. That is good to hear. Uh, did you move for college or did you stay in town? Or in your town rather, I should say. I'm gonna go not up there because that's where... Maybe I'm supposed to go up there. Dude, look how huge this area is. We do have two flags up here. There's the cave they're talking about. Maybe we'll do the... All right, I'm gonna save and we're gonna cross this bridge and hope for the best. All right, don't step on the freaking traps, please. What did I say? Stay out of the cursed oil. Careful now, that's a trap. Where? Loot the dwarf. Yes. Not you. Loot the dwarf. Oops. Okay, well, I didn't mean to do it. Damn it! Apparently I can't click on this dwarf for anything. There you go. Got it. Is it cursed poison? Dude, look at this. Cursed oil and cursed poison. That can't be well. In state, not the same town. I gotcha, I gotcha. 
Well, besides for the crazy, hectic busyness, have you liked college? I'm gonna go up here first. Rope. Aha! What hurt you? A backpack. So many backpacks. Yes, there's traps everywhere. Just, all right, step on it, I guess. That's cool. Wait a minute. Is that a cave? There'll be a void broken here, all right. Ow. Oh, he can climb that. Okay. Careful now. That's a trap. Freaking traps everywhere. This seems ominous. Oh, there is a thing. Don't follow the light. There's no lighthouse and all driftwood, no friendly fire. Oh. Is it like a f false lighthouse? You just turned off the fire. All right. Oh, right on. Yeah, the the freedom's a little nice for sure. But that's cool, you found a paramotor buddy. I'm assuming that's where you have your dirt bike and you have a parachute attached or a paraglider. That sounds fun, actually. Be down for that. Whoa! Son of a shit. What? Is, what? A, they some say something about a statue? Whoa, look at this guy. They have legit wings. Whoa. Oh, there's the statue. Umbral statue. What did you say about the statue? Makes me think I can get away with not killing these guys. Like if I bless the statue, will it... Chill these people out. I don't have bless on any of my people turned on. Damn it. Oh, Ivan's the only one in combat. All right, we can do this. Um. Bless. All right, Fane has bless. <laughs> Excuse me. Damn it. Well, Ben Mez moved, I guess. Let's turn on some horns. Move that. Move that. And... Let's do this. And throw some skeeters. Eat it. Oh, giant fan. Yeah, I've seen those at um, like little mini fairs and stuff. Those look super fun. Oh. Ow. Wait a minute. What? Where did you come from? Reactive shot. Stop. There's so many of them. What level are they? Oh, this is going to hurt. These are level 10s and 12s. Oh. If you hear that, that would be a Jada Borkin. I'm going to try to... He's barking all sorts of loud. Yeah, that looks cursed. I'm going to try to bless that. It was on Fane, right? <laughs> 